my name is Kenzie Brocklebank. I'm a senior in high school and today I want to talk about kids. That is something that I am super passionate about, pouring into kids, teaching them. And so I just want to talk about a few different ways that I'm involved with helping kids out and why I really do it. Um, and I think it really started when I was younger. Um, I'm the oldest of 14 cousins, so I was around kids all the time growing up, learned how to take care of them, things like that. And then I really started getting involved when I went to Africa. Um, my family and I were missionaries there for about two years. We traveled there and back um, multiple times, but we were working in an orphanage and that's really where my love and passion for serving kids came from. And then when I came back in the States, I was 14. Um, and that's when I got my first nanny job for a family with two little girls. I watched them for about nine months every single day of the week um, until they only needed me for about nine months. So then a few months later, I found the family that I currently work for and they have four kids. So. It's definitely chaotic, but I love it. They're homeschooled, so I get to teach them not only life skills, but I get to teach them, you know, math and reading and writing, and I get to just make it fun, which I really enjoy, because I know as when I was growing up, like, that, that stuff really wasn't fun, and I don't want to be someone that's just, like, shoving things down their throat, making them do stuff, so I try to be really creative with how I teach and pour in and just encourage, you know, when something's really hard, I just try to be there, be there for them, allow them to trust me and be able to talk to me when they need to, and just be a positive influence in their lives and be a light. Um, and that is something that I love doing. I get to be with them every day of the week, um, and just watching them grow is probably my favorite thing. When I started working there, the youngest was one. So she didn't really talk much. She slept a lot and things like that. But now she's growing up so fast. She's talking. She's running around. She's telling me what to do because she's three and she's sassy now. But I got home from work today. And I taught her how to ride a bike. Well, in the process of teaching. But it's just so fun to watch them grow, develop and develop and um, just learn life skills and important things as they get older and they start, you know, asking questions. I love to just explain in the like simplest way possible and I just love being someone they can talk to and in my little bits of free time, I'm also a volunteer coach. Um, I coach fifth and sixth grade girls, so about three times a week I'm out on the fields with them, you know, just pouring into them, talking to them, encouraging them. We all love soccer, which is just a great common thing that we have but really my focus in coaching is so much more than just let's be great soccer players let's win every single game you know my primary focus is to just be there for them and encourage them and yes teach them soccer but also teach them important life skills and how can we be a good teammate how can we encourage one another how can we be positive to one another is there anything going on in your life that I can pray for? Anything that you need to talk about maybe privately that, you know, I can just be there for you. I love being an advocate for them and being someone that, hey, maybe maybe they can't really talk to their parents about something, but they really should talk to somebody. I want to be that person that can help guide them, lead them down the right path and making smart choices. So that is just one thing that I absolutely love about kids. It's primarily just jumping in, being the crazy, like, you know, camp counselors when you're a kid, you're like, who is this person? They're so crazy. Like, I love being that person, jumping in and just saying, hey, like, I want to be your friend. I want to talk to you. And, and, and it really works. Like, girls, so many girls come up and talk to me and they remember me. And, and I don't do it for that, but I really love coaching a girl you know, there's a girl that I coached like three or four years ago, and she still comes up to me and talks to me. She's aged out. She doesn't play, you know, anymore with the league that I'm in, but I just love having those relationships. So there's a few other areas in my life that um, I'm involved with kids, but really my main focus is just to pour into them, to love on them, and I really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video and learn just a little bit about my passion for um, helping kids and bettering their lives. So thank you so much.